Hey guys, as you lay dying here. If you're a rusher, you're definitely gonna watch the ground for this video. In this video, we're gonna learn about how to beat campers. Everybody hates them. You know, the guy that sits inside the doorway on Arkadin, or the guy that camps the half wall on village. You know, we all hate them. So, what we want to learn is how do we beat them? Well, really, to effectively beat a camper, you have to know the different types of campers. Because you're going to have to understand the type of camper you're coming up against in order to beat them. So, really in my mind, there's two types of campers. Alright, now you got your corner camper. You know, the guy who, he really, he just sits inside a doorway in the corner of a room, waits for somebody to run through, and then tries, tries to get the kill. Now the thing about these guys that we all kind of have to step back and understand is usually they're really bad and this is the only way that they can get a kill and I know it sucks to get killed by these guys and trust me I I complain about it every time it happens but you almost kinda have to feel bad for them because they're that bad that's how they have to get a kill basically and sometimes unfortunately it, it ruins maybe a good streak or keeps you off a kill streak or something but it's just keep in mind that you know those people have to do that to get a kill you know and then you've got the second type of camper, which is someone who is either average or better than average. Basically someone who's doing what I'm doing in this video, which is taking advantage of the fact that the people that I'm playing against aren't very smart. Okay, and they're, they're the ones that they, they sit near a high traffic area and they pick guys off as they run through. You know, and this is where your where your choke points come into play in games like this or the Call of Duty, and it's the same thing in Battlefield, really. Yeah, and don't tell me there's no camping in Battlefield. We all know there's camping in Battlefield. Don't even give me that stuff. <laughs> you guys want to know how to be really good at Battlefield? I'll give you a little quick tip here in the middle of this video. Okay, to get good at Battlefield, all you have to do is pick up a game case of Call of Duty, hold it right in front of your face, and then just kind of tilt your head up slightly. And then kind of look down and over your nose at that Call of Duty case. Just look down on it. Yeah, okay, now you're good at Battlefield. <laughs> now you're amazing. Alright, anyway. So, uh, where were we? Camping. Okay. You know, in this video, I'm just, just taking advantage of these guys, you know? And this is what all of us as rushers need to learn about these campers, is they are taking advantage of the fact that we are just throwing our bodies in front of them for us to repeatedly kill. And by us, I mean me, because I do this, obviously, as you can see in this video. You know, these guys, and don't get me wrong, these guys, a lot of them are pretty newbie. But, I mean, I don't even have to go anywhere. I don't have to move to kill these guys. They're coming to me, and they're making it easy on me. Why would I run away? Why would I leave this spot if they keep coming there? You know, I don't have to go anywhere to get these kills. They're just flooding right through. And this is what you guys as rushers need to understand is if you keep dying in one area I mean if you're on the other enemy team and you keep running under that gate and just dying whether it's by one guy or a different guy or some other guy stop going there I see people do it all the time they'll run up they'll die they'll run up they'll die they'll run up like that guy they'll throw a flash grenade and then they'll die guess what if you if you flash me right here I'm already looking directly at you so chances are, if I don't get a few bullets on you and kill you, you know, I'm probably going to injure you and the next guy behind me is going to kill you. I mean, flash grenades, stun grenades, they're not going to help you out that much. You're better off throwing an explosive and you're better off yet just going a different way. Okay, flank. Okay, going back to the battlefield guys, those guys know how to flank. You got to get around the side of the camper. Go around where he's not expecting you. See, this guy, he came in from the side. If I had been there, I probably never would have seen him coming. And that's the way you get around people like this, is you stop running directly at them, and you start going around them. Now the problem people run into when they, when they try to get around a camper is they, they focus so much on that camper that they don't care about anything else. They run for him, and they sprint, and then someone jumps out from some other spot and kills them, you know, which makes them rage even more. Trust me, I do that all the time. If you're going to flank, you have to be expecting other enemies, and you have to kill them, and then you, and then you get to have your fun with the camper. But you can't just keep running at them because, as you can see in this video, these guys are just making it very, very easy for me. I, I mean, I've probably played on a very small percentage of this map during this whole game. And I, as, as you're going to see, I'm going to have by far the most kills on anybody on my team. 
So that's really what you need to do as a, as a rusher to beat a camper. You need to stop letting them win at their own game. Stop running in and letting them shoot you because, you know, it's just, just letting them win. Whether they're camping or not, they're going to win. All right, guys, so I hope that helped you. I hope, uh, you know, if you're a rusher, I hope this maybe opens your eyes a little bit. Maybe next time you're getting killed by a camper, you'll flank them. You'll do something a little different, change it up, catch them off guard, and uh, kill them. Definitely. So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have a good day.